Although it's pretty obvious that Amber Heard should be fired from the Aquaman 2 sequel, the DC Extended Universe's film production company that was supposed to make the decision seems to have missed the obvious. Now, they are getting huge media backlash, thanks to the negative comments against one of their lead actresses, Amber Heard. Before the whole Aquaman 2 filming ever began, we all knew, and if you didn't then you should listen to this next fact, that millions of fans were against Amber Heard's role reprisal in the upcoming Aquaman second installment that stars Jason Momoa and other huge stars such as Nicole Kidman, Patrick Wilson, Willem Dafoe, and Randall Park. Such a big cast ensemble, and that alone proves that Warner Brothers can pay huge stars for their roles. Now what's up with recasting Amber Heard? You may remember that a huge number of supporters filed for a petition to be signed with the aim to request Warner Brothers to fire Amber Heard from her role as Queen Mera, the same way they forced Johnny to leave Fantastic Beasts. However, even after garnering more than 1.6 million signatures, Warner Brothers still pushed through, having Amber reprise her role. A lot of fans were upset by this, and we mean upset. Everywhere you look on social media, there were mean comments about Amber, and sadly, about the upcoming Aquaman film itself. There's no doubt that the first Aquaman, directed by James Wan, was a huge hit, and it deserved every inch of success because it's aesthetically and cinematically beautiful in many, many aspects. Yet, during the promotion period, it had been noticeable that people were planning to not watch the movie and even campaign for others to boycott it too, in honor of their support for Johnny Depp, who has been let go from his role as Grindelwald in the Fantastic Beasts film series. Both movies are set to premiere in 2022, and both movies are going to be under Warner Brothers. But what is keeping Warner Brothers head over heels for this actress who is currently dealing with a huge lawsuit in front of her and a number of pieces of evidence against her, proving that she is not all that she claims to be? With everything that's going on in Johnny and Amber's post-divorce chaos, it is indeed safe to say that Amber's name is in the hot seat, and not in a positive way. Well, it turns out that they are obviously risking it. Several people are slowing turning to Johnny's side. So, in the middle of this all, fans can't help but make their own bets on who would be the suitable replacement for her cast as Queen Mera. There are tons of different actresses that would fit the role, but it seems like in the last few months, while this situation against casting Amber is happening, fans' eyes are falling on one of the most talented young British actresses on TV nowadays, Amelia Clark. Well, the first time you hear the name Amelia Clark, the first thing your brain shouts is the word perfect, and she is indeed. Tons of fans all over the internet are pitching in their own suggestions, but no name has surfaced more than Amelia. During the last few months, before Warner Brothers announced the start of their filming, there were rumors circulating that Warner Brothers were indeed looking into Amelia as a replacement for Mera's role. And apart from this, there were also rumors that Amber would be replaced due to her health condition. She'd put on some pounds and was in terrible shape. There was a clause in her contract which said that she was required to be in good form ahead of shooting and she had violated that. But these rumors of Amelia replacing her were never proven, and now the announcements and Amber's social media posts herself say otherwise. But why do we think Amelia Clark would be the perfect person to play Queen Mera? Well, there's a number of reasons, from rekindling her romance with Game of Thrones co-star Jason Momoa, to her incredible acting skills that would definitely benefit the portrayal of the Atlantean Queen, and to her proven huge fan base. Stay tuned because we are about to enumerate all the reasons for you. But first, make sure to hit that subscribe button and smash the notification bell for more updates. So, here are some of the biggest reasons why Amelia Clark is the best female celeb to replace Amber Heard in Aquaman 2. Number 1. She is one of the biggest and most celebrated female stars today. Widely known as Daenerys Targaryen, Amelia Clark is one of the biggest and highest paid actresses today. Landing a lead role in one of the highest grossing series of all time was really a huge, huge break, and Amelia is obviously at the height of her career. But it certainly shows that the DCEU has its own extensive budget for huge stars, and it is indeed possible for them to cast Amelia as Mera. But aside from Amelia's thick portfolio in Game of Thrones alone, 
which ran for eight seasons in a span of eight long years. She also has a long list of other TV shows and movies in her IMDb that if you were living in a cave and have not seen Game of Thrones yet, you will still be able to recognize Amelia Clark in any movie. These include movies like Me Before You, Terminator Genesis, Last Christmas, Solo A Star Wars Story, Voice from the Stone, and many more. Apart from all these, we all know that Amelia Clark has a clean record for her past jobs history. And if there's anything you can say about her, well, aside from doing the role of a lifetime in Game of Thrones, we got nothing. So yeah, she might require a higher pay than Amber Heard, but her name alone, added by Jason Momoa's reputation, guarantees a high return in blockbuster billions. Number 2. Fans would love to see Jason Momoa and Amelia Clark back as an on-screen pair. It is never easy to replace a cast member, especially a well-loved cast member, in a film's second installment. However, if Warner Brothers did this decision as easily with Johnny Depp, considering how it might agitate his fans, then it must also be an easy feat for the production company to replace Amber Heard, as well as especially in the midst of her getting into all kinds of messes. While it is never easy with the fans, but in this case of course it is, when an actor is replaced in a franchise, it may go down better with viewers when they see Jason and Amelia reunite as an on-screen pair. The biggest reason why Amelia Clark is a good replacement for Amber Heard in Aquaman 2 is that she is a fan favorite since her past role with Jason Momoa on Game of Thrones. In Game of Thrones, the pair shared the screen as a team, and not only just as partners, but as lovers who pretty much filmed the whole Game of Thrones series with love and unspeakable romance. And even though their love for each other is not a thing in real life, who doesn't want to see them look at each other again and melt? This previous collaboration that turned out beautifully prompted the previous theories of Amelia supplanting Amber as Mara in the DCU, and we fans love it! Number 3. Amelia's siren-like physique can surely rock the Queen Mara suit. Amidst the chaos between Johnny Depp and Amber Heard, fans are already eyeing Amelia Clark as the latter's replacement in Aquaman 2. And of all the female celebrities surfacing for the role, her name always pops up the most. And because of this, many fans have also invested their time and effort trying to prove this by creating fan art which instantly became fan favorites. These fan arts prove that Amelia can indeed rock the Atlantean Queen's fitted siren costume. And those long locks of luscious caramel hair? Well, they have proven to be beautiful in platinum blonde once. What are the odds that it won't flow as stunningly in bright red orange? This artwork from Instagram user JPH underscore Photoshop gives Amelia Clark a Queen Mara makeover for Aquaman 2, with the Game of Thrones star rocking the signature red hair, which has been synonymous with the character ever since she was created by Jack Miller and Nick Cardi way back in 1963's Aquaman No. 11. The concept design also shows Amelia wearing the bright green Atlantean bodysuit Amber Heard wore in the first film. But given that all these will remain merely fantasies for fans, we'll just wait for 2022 and see how Aquaman 2 goes. That's all for today. We hope you enjoyed that video. And if you did, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more videos like this.